How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. It's been a little while since my last video, but it's good to be back. I got a brand new computer, so everything should hopefully be running smoothly. Today is an exciting day because it is the start of Battle Pass Season 10. Perfect time to get back into making videos, I think. And let's go ahead and take a look at the new Battle Pass. Now, BMG was nice enough to give me the Battle Pass Deluxe for free. And they, I guess that comes with a 25 free tiers. So I got all of these for free. But let's go ahead and start at the beginning and see what we got here. So the premium skin right off the bat is Fallen Prince Taros. As you can see, the level one, two, and three looks really cool. Level one is looking a lot like the beast in Beauty and the Beast to me. And then level two looks cool with the armor. And then level three, Kind of looks like Hell Inferno Taros. Very, very, very cool. And to level that Taros up, I believe all we have to do... Let's look at the missions. Is win matches with eight or more strength on any legend that has eight or more strength. We just have to win matches. I'm already 11 out of 40, so that's not going to be too hard. To level up the podium, we have to grab weapons as they're being carried by a sidekick. Also not very hard so those are pretty easy ones this time around to level up the progression skin and the podium let's go ahead and look at the rest of the battle pass real quick here though uh, just to take a look because I haven't really looked at it a whole lot we got the podium here and it looks like level one two and three are very different on what they look like I really like those so let's just quickly look here we got the new color scheme Kira Kira Magical gateway loading frame looks very cool. I think I already equipped it. Let's just go ahead and make sure Yeah, I do have that equipped All right, and I got the podium equipped as well Victory emo I, I think I went ahead and equipped all the new emotes that I have so far So I'll go ahead and use those in a match so you guys can see what they look like. I don't really use the uh, The rage emoji too much. So I'm not really gonna equip that I don't think but there you go miracle magi uh, right there and then the Valiant Armament Armament Rocket la Lance, which looks pretty cool. <laughs> no, I can't stumbling over those words, but yeah the Tuxedo Bandit Caspian Kind of giving me vibes of the Lucian with the big hat uh, I don't remember what the skin is, but there's a skin for Lucian that has a big hat Very cool. We're gonna go ahead and play that skin in this episode today for you guys and another avatar there, Tragedy of the Fallen Prince. It's pretty cool. Valiant Arm Armament Axe. That's a cool looking axe skin. We need to go ahead and use that. Fallen Prince Sweat. Oh my gosh, that laugh. <laughs> wow. Uh, so that's where I am on the battle pass so far. But let's go ahead and see what else we have coming up here. We got Daylight Star, Mag Magi Fate. The whole theme of the battle pass is, is kind of giving me Sailor Moon vibes. So that's the new color scheme. You could actually see it. Kira Kira. It's kind of like an ice blue, light pink. I like it. It's not the best, not the worst, but it's definitely not the worst. I would put it more towards uh, one of the better looking color schemes for a battle pass. And can you believe this is battle pass 10? The 10th battle pass for Brawlhalla. It's kind of crazy. Got a little doggy sidekick or whatever. Uh, Celestial Dreams UI theme is looking really good. I can't wait to get that at tier 43. Oh, the Power of Friendship Buddy Emo. And it's got Fusion Ha technique from Dragon Ball Z. Love to see it. And then the Mecha Knight Magyar. Oh, that is so cool. I love the Mecha skins. We also have quite a few Mecha skins now. We got Mecha Azuri, Mecha Ragnar, Mecha Taros. I don't even remember all of them, but there's a lot of Becca skins, so that's really cool. He looks like Optimus Prime. Love to see that. That's a tier 50. Got a ways to go to get that. Some more Mammoth Coins. Transformation Dance. All right. He doesn't really transform. Be cool if he, if he did, but... Valiant Armament Bow. All right. Looks kind of basic. Valiant Armament Orb. This looks awesome. It'd be cooler if it was animated or, or something, but that's a cool looking orb. Got a well-played Caspian there. Another skin. This one's for Thea. Fleeting mag Magi. Pretty cool. The unicorn spike on the helmet is like deadly looking. Looks like she could use her forehead as a weapon. <laughs> oh, man. And then the scythe is kind of all right, I guess. 
Another sidekick, Fufu. The spear looks pretty cool. The weapon skins are not bad. They're not bad at all. Oh, I love that one. The astonishment uh, emoji. Tier 77. We're very close to the final tier. Those gauntlets are clean. Pet the sidekick. We have sidekick high five, and now we have pet the sidekick. All right. And here's the knockout effect. All right, I mean, it's a flower. I'm not really sure why that's a knockout effect, but it's all right, it looks pretty cool, I guess. Not the worst, not the best. Hoshi sidekick, I like it. The sword, it, it almost looks like a great sword, it's so big. Last but not least, guys. Miracle Magi Starlet Mirage. Very, very cool. The skin itself is all right. Let's see what the signatures look like. All right, so we, we don't get the fully animated looking signatures yet. We're gonna have to wait till we actually unlock her to see what they look like, I guess. But there you go. The signatures will look different, and then there's the weapons. Honestly, I think the weapons are what I'm most excited for. The skin itself is all right, but the weapons look beautiful. All right, so let's go ahead and play a few games with the skins we do have. Fallen Prince Taros and Tuxedo Caspian. We need Hammer Light and Bow Heavy, so uh, before I, I jump into probably Strikeout, let's go ahead and look at Fallen Prince Taros with different colors. Because I have pretty much every color in the game for Taros, except maybe Skyforged and Goldforged. I don't think I have those two for Taros. But I do have them for Caspian, so we should be able to see those. Bifrost I like. Raven's Honor looks good on almost every skin. And I do have black colors for every legend in the game, except Imugi. I'm very close on Imugi. Let's go ahead and look. I'm t I'm level 23 and a half with Imugi, so once I get Imugi to 25, I'll have black colors for every legend again. But anyways, let's look at uh, Fallen Prince, or sorry, Tuxedo Bandit Caspian in the different colors. I believe I have every color in the game unlocked for Caspian, so we can see the full swing of colors. Wow, I think Gold Forge is my favorite. Uh, that one looks the best to me, or Skyforge. Uh, Armageddon. Honestly, they're all pretty good. They're all good. There's like, it's all a matter of personal preference anyways, but I, I like a lot of them. That being said, I tend to use the same like three different color schemes every time, but... All right, so let's go ahead and start it out with Fallen Prince Taros. I'll do the default weapons for now, but next... Actually, let's do Strikeout so we can play more than one character. Uh, next... Next game, though, I'm going to use the new Axe skin that we got as well. Let's go ahead and throw in a Moogie, and uh, hopefully we can get some XP for a Moogie. It's good to be back, guys. Very good to be back. Wish me luck. Haven't recorded a Brawlhalla video in a long time. I literally sold my house and moved to a different state, if you've been wondering where I've been on YouTube. But I should have a lot more time to make videos going forward and I also have a brand new computer so I'm looking forward to making videos not just of Brawlhalla but other games as well right now I'm playing through uh, Black Myth Wukong wow that game is good the graphics are amazing in that game all right here we go going against Flask 0088 uh, here's here's some of the new emotes <laughs> all right Let's get it on. I'm not the best with hammer, so forgive me if I'm... Oh my goodness. This guy is good at baiting attacks. Like, very good. Very, very good. I'm, I'm literally getting read like a book here. But it don't matter how you start, only how you finish. Right, guys? Uh, well, I died, but at least we damaged him to orange. <laughs> Caspian, save me. I'm much better with Caspian than I am with Taros. So I should be able to get this right back where it needs to be. He's, he's playing very uh, defensively. He doesn't really want to engage. He wants to wait until I swing and miss and then try to punish every single time. Not what I meant to do, but... Uh-oh. Oh, no. He 
He is a good cannon player. He likes to wait and see if he can hit that recovery. Like every single time. Oh, oh my goodness. I'm still alive, buddy. I'm still alive. Yo. This is going to be a good match. This guy is very good. I can tell. Oh, buddy. And uh, we, we died pretty fast on uh, Taros. So the fact that we're even like about to take the lead, and we do. Like I said, how you finish. If you have a bad start to a game, don't give up. You never know how it's going to end until you get to the end. Except for sometimes you, you do kind of have an idea, but you know what I mean. Oh, I thought he was going to do a neutral sig, but that works too. The good old base default skin Sir Roland. All right, well, we made it all the way to Amugi, so... This is a legend I've been playing a lot of, so... I am pretty familiar with the signatures and everything. So basically, if I lose, no excuse on this. I'm not saying I'm, like, super good with Amugi, but... We should have this. Oh, come on, Sir Roland. Oh, I did not need to do that. He could finish it right here. This is such a close game. <gasps> What's going to happen? Oh my goodness. Not like this, Sir Roland. No, oh my gosh, I'm still alive, baby. Let's go. Oh, oh. No way. Not like that. Wow. All right, well, a win's a win. Didn't I didn't think that would actually kill him. Good game, good game, well played. Look at that victory pose. You want a rematch, Flask? Yeah, let's do a rematch. That was a look at the damage done and taken on mine. 580 and 580. Wow. Don't know how it's different for him. Maybe because he like hit himself with a bomb or something. I have no idea how that works. I didn't make a video on these new uh, skins, so let's go ahead and play Lilith. She's a crossover for Reno. And by the way, guys, I have a ton of codes that are going to be expiring soon. So I'm going to be dropping them in the comments after this video. So definitely uh, be checking the comments. Every time I release a Brawlhalla video, I'm dropping codes. So let's go. Let's see if we could beat Flask again. He is pretty good. And it looks like he switched up his characters. So all new characters for him. We're using the same ones again, but that's all right. Actually, I changed my last character, but the first two are going to be the same. Oh, buddy. That's a good one. I think Hammer is really good against Scythe. Especially when I have Taros. I only need to hit like once or twice with this Hammer. One more good hit and he is toast. I'll kill him even with light attacks if I have to. Oh, buddy. This is another close game. Oh, that actually hit. All right, let's go back to the axe. Oh, I forgot to change the axe. I wanted to do the new skin. That's all right. Hold that. Oh, never mind. I threw it the wrong way. Let's try to do a little more damage here. Never mind, I'm dead. Well, we got him to yellow, second stock. 
So we're doing better than we did last game, because last game, he actually got first stock on us, remember? You could dodge the weapon, but you could not dodge my fist. Buddy. He is going to die by the guitars, I'm feeling it. No, I ain't falling into that one, buddy. Oh, he tried to side sig right into my side sig, and mine is just gonna eat him up every time. Ow, that hurt. Oh, the flame. Okay. Final stocks again against Flask. <laughs> Both games. I got hair in my mouth. Oh, my gosh. Oh, this looks so cool. I love Lilith on this. Oh, baited. Oh, buddy. That it? Oh! Ho, ho. GG, GG. That was a good match. Well played, dude. Well played. Alright, I'll do one more game because we didn't actually get to use the new axe skin and I've been wanting to do that. Let's see. Let's find it. There it is. Look at that beauty. And then we'll do cast speed again. And last but not least, how about the new Scarlet skin? Why not? No way. We're going against Flask again, guys. Oh, my gosh. All three matches against Flask. Can we... Perfect him three games in a row. Three, two, or one, win three games four. in a row, I should say. I give you my love in a spirit bomb. Look at that axe. You know you like this axe skin flask. Oh, right in the face. I should have used a different hammer skin too, but that's alright. This axe is so cool. Almost got you. I think we're going to do much better this time. Get that out of here, boy. Bye bye. Oh, what? The reversal. Oh, I made it. Oh, what a finish, bro. I can't believe I actually made it back, but I also can't believe he edge guarded that so well. I, I cannot underestimate Flask. We've had too many close games. Oh, yeah. Boom. Flask, you make me chase a little too much. More than I like. The worst part is, it's not really working for you, so you should probably change up your style. If I have to chase you around, I will.
Oh, buddy. Not the only one who can Katark. Oh, we are looking at a much better win here. Even if I die now, we have done much better. Oh, flame to my toes. All right, who we got? Oh, yeah. Tiny Tina or whatever, the new Scarlet skin. And boom. That's game. GG to GG. We're getting more and more convincing win on you, Flask. No rematch that time. All right. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like and be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. I'm going to be putting it out there. I think next time we're going to probably have this new Fate skin unlocked. So maybe I'll make a video with this skin. That would be pretty cool. Daylight Star Magi Fate. Let me know which skin in the Battle Pass is your favorite. I'm probably going to have to go with Mecha Knight Magyar myself. Either that or the Tier 3 Tarot skin. That one was really good too. Alright guys, this is Lucian Sword. Take it easy.